Hey guys, if you want to learn Arduino and create cool home automation projects, robotic projects and other fun DIY projects, then you have come to the right place. Imagine creating amazing Arduino IoT projects like weather stations, automatic garden watering systems and home automation with minimal prior knowledge of coding and networking. With minimal setup time, using only your computer and a browser, you can upload your code to your Arduino board wirelessly from anywhere around the world. Arduino Cloud make all this and much much more possible. In the previous video, I gave you a detailed introduction to Arduino, explaining what Arduino is, how to set it up and how to upload your first code. In this video, we'll be exploring Arduino Cloud which will enable you to create amazing IoT projects in just a few minutes in the easiest way possible. Trust me guys, this is going to be a game changer for all the hobbies and DIY enthusiasts. So guys, let's get started. As you know, IoT technology is transforming our lives, making our home smarter and efficient. From smart thermostat to security system, IoT devices are enhancing our daily routines. Arduino Cloud is a smart, efficient and comprehensive way of development of IoT. It allows users to build visual dashboards, monitor devices and control them remotely with very little setup. With Arduino IoT Cloud, you can control your projects from anywhere around the world. Just imagine being able to check on your garden's watering system or your home's lighting system when you are on a vacation. Don't believe me? Well, say for yourself. Check out these cool projects that we made using Arduino Cloud. We created a smart home automation system to control home appliances using Arduino Cloud, a door locking system with Arduino Cloud and Alexa integration, a cocktail dispenser that mixes drinks in the right proportions, and even a rocket launcher using Arduino Cloud. How cool is that? And the interesting thing is, you don't have to be an expert in programming or coding in order to build all these things. Every aspect of Arduino Cloud is designed to be user-friendly. The smart interfaces makes it simple to set up and manage your IoT projects. And by the way guys, you will find all these tutorials and much much more in our channel. So make sure you check it out. You can access the Arduino Cloud through cloud.arduino.cc. You only need an internet connection and an Arduino account. After signing in, you are taken to your private space on the Arduino Cloud. Once you log in, you should be able to see this menu on the left hand side. And there, you should be able to see something called things. A thing is basically a project. So in this section, you should be able to see every project that you have worked on or you are currently working on. Additionally, you should see another menu called devices. Devices are boards that you will be using for the project. And here, the good thing is Arduino Cloud not only support official Arduino boards, but it also support other third party boards as well. That means you will be able to do a lot of cool projects with so many different kinds of boards using Arduino Cloud. Once you add a board here, you can easily associate it with a project or a thing and declare all the variables you will be using. If the board supports Wi-Fi connectivity, you can simply provide your Wi-Fi username and password here. If you want smart home integration such as Amazon Alexa or Google Home, you can configure it right here. That's cool, right? But guys, if you find it confusing, don't worry about it guys, we'll be going through each and every aspect of this Arduino Cloud. I'll be explaining everything in an easy to understand manner. So we'll get back to it. So guys, once you have set up everything, it's time for coding. And believe me guys, it's really, really easy. When you start coding, it will generate a sample code that will automatically declare all the variables being used for this project, set up Wi-Fi connectivity, and connect to the Arduino IoT Cloud. So all the hard work is already taken care of. You don't need to worry about it. You just need to modify this code with whatever you think you need to do with these variables. And another thing is, there are a lot of libraries readily available that you can use with your code. You can select which library you want from the menu on the left hand side of the editor, making coding a lot lot easier. If you want to add any custom library, you can do that as well. Once you have finished coding, you can simply upload the code to your Arduino board. And in order to upload your code from the browser to your Arduino board, you need to install a small piece of software that will be handling all the communication between the Arduino board and the browser. And the best part is, you can upload your code to your Arduino board from your browser wirelessly. 
You don't need to connect this Arduino board to your computer. With Arduino Cloud, you can upload code to a Wi-Fi supported Arduino board over the air. Once the code is uploaded, Arduino board will connect to Arduino Cloud using the Wi-Fi network that you have configured when you created the project. And once it is done, it will start updating the variables. Now we can link all these variables to different kinds of visualizations in the dashboards and observe all the data in a visually interactive manner. You can even see these dashboards and visualizations and control everything with the Arduino IoT Remote App. The Arduino IoT Remote App makes it super easy and fun to manage your IoT projects right from your phone and tablets. And guys, most of the features are free, so you can get started right now. You are ready to get started with Arduino Cloud. And let's go to the next video.